roads damaged by landslides and torrential rains. Days after Cyclone Chineso hit Madagascar, the island's people are still picking up the pieces. Thousands have been displaced. Many of them have been set up in temporary shelters, like this one at a public primary school in the city of Mahajanga. We came because our homes were destroyed by strong hurricane winds. In my case, the house started to cave in, so I ran away. It was totally destroyed. We are asking for help, especially for people like us. We have nothing. We don't have enough work to support ourselves. And many of us are single mothers. Many of us are sick or elderly. The shelter started taking people in on Sunday, several days after the cyclone made landfall. It's now weakened, but it's still wrecking havoc. On the other side of the island, several inhabitants said poor infrastructure was to blame. Everything is flooded here. We have asked the state to improve the draining of flood water so that in case of rain it can flow away. Right now, we're living in misery. The water should flow into the sea, but there is no drainage, especially in the irrigation canals below. They are blocked, and as a result, the water enters our homes. The country is no stranger to inclement weather. Last year, it was hit by two cyclones and several tropical storms in the span of just one month. 